Okay, when you have a similar figures, there is a very interesting ratio between these two similars. Okay, similar. For example, if we have a circle, this is a circle is one. The red is two, is it? This circle is oh, two, three. Okay, there is a two to three. There is one ratio, right? So I'm going to use a, you can use, this is a ratio unit, not real radius, okay? This is a ratio unit. This is reset ratio unit, not dimension, okay? Ratio unit. If this is two part, the other side is one, three part, that's it, okay? That's what we use, what this is a unit. Is it okay? So ratio of the length, actually ratio of the length is that should be corresponding side. Radius to radius, circumference to circumference, diameter to diameter, they are all like corresponding size, they are all lengths. If less of length, A to B, but in this case, two to three, right? Circumference, four pi, six pi, there is a circumference. When you simplify, still, two to three, isn't it? Diameter, four to six, twice. When you simplify, two to three, they are all equal, right? The ratio of the lengths, Ratio of what? Any corresponding lengths, they are always same ratio. That is the ratio of the lengths. Okay? Area is different, it's similar. Okay? Area not two to three. Can you see area? Pi r squared is what? Four pi. Pi r squared is nine pi. Can you see that? This is area. Pi pi is out. Four to nine. Different. How about the four? Two square. I don't got nine, three square. Okay, in similar ratio of the length is two to three. Ratio of the area is always two square to three square. That's it, over here. Can you see it over here? What about volume? Q, that's it. What is the volume of a sphere? You know that? Four pi r is two cube over three, right? That is the volume of a sphere. You know that. Another volume of sphere, which is ball, right? It's a rounding ball. So four pi r cube, right? So r is three cube over three, isn't it? When you cancel it all other one, still one, two cube, two, three cube. Okay? This is scale, okay? If you sometimes SAT doesn't give right dimensions, okay? That's why if you use this tool, sometimes it is what? easier to get the answer, okay? If you don't like this one, you don't have to, okay? Just uh, uh, go and uh, just uh, use your uh, the classic method. It's okay too, okay? So I'm gonna solve this in two different way. Okay, one is a classic, this is by using this tool, all right? Okay. This is two to three, okay? This is two to three, maybe you can say Oh, this is two to three. You can use the K there, express what they are real dimension. This is what, two K, three K. You can use this one, right? All right. So what is the area of this one? Watch the area of this one. Watch the area of this one. Pi R square, pi times two K square. That's the area. The other one is what? Pi times three K square. That's the other area. Right? The area of a circle, oh, this is 20, this is 20. So what is the area? Okay, using right by all the method, okay? So how much this one? Okay, two, you see there? Four, K square, and pi, no, four K square, right? Four, sorry about that. <laughs> 4k square pi, that is equal to 20. But this is how much? 9k square over pi, isn't it? Can you see that? 4k square over pi is what? Divided by 4 equals 5. This is a 5. What about this one? This is equals 5, isn't it? That's what 9 times 5 is what? 45. Okay? So you can solve this way too. You can solve this way too. Or from the area, you can find what the radius directly, okay? This is another method. If you could use the R, the other radius we don't know, right? That's what, two to three, we don't know. What is this R? Pi R squared equals 20, isn't it? So 
So what is R? R squared is what? 20 over pi, R equals one. Square root, 20 over square pi, that's it. But this is two to three. The other one is how much? The other one is three over two times this one. Three over pi, that's the radius. Now find the area, pi times, wow. 3 over 2, red, 30 over pi, pi r squared, that's it. How do you think? A lot of work, right? A lot of work. Okay, now let's do this one using a ratio of similars. Okay. Maybe if you, one of you guys, okay, uh, in, interest, interested in, uh, Google or Amazon or Goldman Sachs big company, when they have interval, okay, interview, they give us some uh, questions like this one. If you solve this way, okay, it's right. I have to sorry, okay, I have to say sorry, okay. <laughs> they cannot hide, okay. If you solve this way, definitely you can be higher. Why? This is what? Test. Okay? This new tools. Right? This is a millennium tools, not old, old, old passion tools. Okay? Take a look here. We know the corresponding side, that the ratio of the length is what? Two to three. Okay, right down over here. The ratio of the length is two to three. It's that similar, right? Every circles, all Circles are similar, we know that. What is the ratio of the area? Two square, two, three square is nine, that's it. So using this ratio, you define each area. If this area is a 4K, the other area will be 9K, that's it, okay? This is now real area, but still we need to find the K, right? Okay. Why can't you give an overview? This area is 20, this area is 20, this area. What is the value of K? K is 5, put this number K is 5 over here. What is the other area? 9 times 5 is 45, that's it. Our thing. So if you stick with all the person method, right? It depends on you, right? That's why ratio of similarity is very important. Is it okay? Now take for number two. We check number two. Oh, this is A over B is five over two. A is five, B over two. This is a ratio unit. This is a five, this is a two. Not dimension, but this is a ratio unit. If you have a, this is a five unit. This is a three unit, a two unit, that's it. Okay? Right. So corresponding size, isn't it? The ratio of the length. Right? So what is the ratio of the length? The ratio of the length. Ratio of the lengths, A to B, oh, five to B, I'm sorry, five to B. What is the ratio of there? Because what, this is equilateral triangle, okay? Equilateral triangle, every equilateral triangle, they are similar, we know that. Every square, every circle, yes? Okay. Five square is 25, two square is one, four, okay? Length is 2.5, area is almost more than six times, it is 6.25, right? Okay. Length is what? 2.5. 2.5 square is what? 6.25. Yeah, that's true. All right. Area of this ABCA, this area is 30. What is the other area? What is this area? This is the area ratio of 25 to the 4. This is, if this is 25K, the other one is, will be 4K, that's it. But this 25K is what turn out to be 30, right? This is turn out to be 30. What is the value of K? 1.2, isn't it? Right, 30 divided by 25 is 1.2. Put this number 1.2 over here, okay? Four times 1.2 is about 4.8. This area is about 4.8. Can you see that? Okay, try number three. Five over two times, this is five. Small bridge two, that's the meaning, right? 
small circumference have to come out. Small circle, large circle. This is to this is the part. Rest of the length, this is corresponding, which is the which are radius, radial, right? So this is two to five. What is the ratio of zero? Two square is four, five square is twenty-five. That's it. If this area is about four k, the other area is how much? Sixteen or oh no? Twenty-one k, right? Twenty-five minus oh no, just twenty-five k is there. Shady region, right? Take a look. Oh, they're not actually shady region. A small one is twenty-eight k. This is twenty-eight. This is twenty-eight. What is there with shady region? You can take a shady region, 25k minus 4k, 21k, or if you find 25k, how much? If k is 7, right? This is 7. 25, 7 is 175, isn't it? All right, this is 175, small region 28. Take off 175 minus 28. How much? 1.7, right? Is okay? 1.7 is the area of the shady region. Or you can take a 25k minus 4k, this is 21k, right? If you find the k over here, which is not for k, it doesn't matter. It's the same thing, no bigger. That is number three. Number four, now move on number four over here. We have three circles there, it doesn't matter, right? Four, five, it doesn't matter. Three to the one, if this is three, this is the one. Ratio is the this ratio of the length of this circle is three to the one. But we have another one, larger one, okay? From here, right? This is another three. This is another one, four diameter four, half of that four, isn't it? Is it okay? Eight divided by two is about four, right? The small circle, small circle one, medium size, three, largest one, largest one. It's four. The ratio of the legs corresponds to the side, which are radial, right? So one, two, three to the four. That's the ratio of the radius. Is okay? What is the ratio of their area? What is the ratio of the area? One square is one, three square is nine, four square is 16. Using this one to find this area with a K, one K. This area is the K. This area is the second one is the nine K. Largest area is one. 16K, but using this one, right? Shady region, this shady region. 16K, whole thing is 16K, isn't it? But inside it, 1K, but this is not 1K, this is the 1K, right? The other one is 9K. Take off these two, right? 9 plus 1K is one, 10K, 16k minus 10k is how much? 16 minus 10k is what? 6k, right? This is the same as the reader. This is a given 96 pi. This is 96 pi. What is the value of k? k equals what? Divided by 6. 60 pi, isn't it? Is it okay? Now we're going to find what? L. Oh, no, no. The radius of this one. This is K. Oh, this K is my area. 16 pi is already over here. This area is 16 pi. Watch the radius. Pi R squared is my radius. You know? So pi down. R squared is 16. Radius is 4. This radius is 4. Is it okay? The real radius is 4. Number 4. Take a number five or more, okay? Same as right before, small tri small circle, medium circle, large circle, it doesn't matter. These three triangles are also similar, isn't it? This is a common angle. Angle, right angle, 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 congruent. All these three triangles are similar, right? I'm gonna write down the ratio of the unit. Ratio of unit is this is a two, this is a two, this is three. This is a ratio unit, not dimensions. Maybe you can use a small one. I'm gonna get rid of make it small. Medium size. A largest size is one, A, B, C, isn't it? You can use this ratio unit, okay? This is three. Now this is what? Two plus three is five. Largest one, two plus two plus three is uh, how much? Seven, right? That is a corresponding ratio.
ratio. Ratio, ratio of the legs, seven, five, three. What is the ratio of the area? Seven square, 49. 25 square, five square, 25. Three square is a nine. This ratio of this one. Now put this K, express what their area, okay? If this area is 9K, medium size circle is 25K, large circle is, should be 49K, that's it, okay? But still, we have one more work. What is that? Find the value of K, right? Because what? We need the real area, okay? So we need to find the K, that's why. This is the area, right? A, B, C, isn't it? Okay. Now, where are we? We have to find the K over here. Take a look. P, Q, R, S. This area is 40A. Okay. All together is 25K, isn't it? But this area is smaller than 9K. Take a look. 25K minus 9K equals 16K, right? This area is what? 16K. From here, we can find the value of K. 48 equals 16K. K equals how much? 3, isn't it? K equals 3. Right? K equals 3. Now we need what? The area of a triangle. ABC is the largest one, 49K. So 49K is now 3, okay? Well, how much is it? Well, 1.7, isn't it? Okay. The last one is PQ is a parallel. This is a parallel. Yeah. These two triangles are similar too. These triangles are similar too. We know that. Angle. Alternated triangle. Okay. Angle. Angle congruent. All right. The ratio of the area is given. The ratio of the area. No, this is a big word. The ratio of the area is what? Four to nine. What is the length? Square root 4 is what? 2, 2, square root 9 is a 3, you know? Ratio of length is now 2, 2, 3. Premier is what? Same length. Using this word, the other corresponding perimeter, same perimeter, perimeter to perimeter, still what? 2, 2, 3. If this perimeter is together with the perimeter, this perimeter, PQM. Somewhere not together. This perimeter is what, two, okay. The other perimeter, three K, is it? Okay, PQM, this perimeter is now how much? 15, okay? From here, K equals how much? 7.5, it's okay? 7.5. Put this number over here. Three times 7.5, 22.5, right? That's the perimeter of the other triangle, this 